My name is Charlotte and this is my intern Juliet and we work in the historic clothing department at the New Canaan Museum in Connecticut. You're going to want to watch this one. Somehow we missed a wedding dress in our past through the storage last year because I've never seen this one and it's in perfect condition. This is an 1894 two-piece wedding dress that originally belonged to Mary Abbott whose father Leon Abbott was the governor of New Jersey in the 19th century. Mary married Andrew Post on April 11th, 1894, and according to donation records, the dress was passed down through the family to be worn again in 1950 by Jane Kay. The records do get really spotty around this period, though, and we couldn't get much more information beyond that. The donation also included two pairs of shoes, which I will have to find on another day. The dress features extravagant leg of mutton sleeves, which reached their apex around this time. These ones are the size of basketballs. If you've seen the movie Labyrinth, the style definitely comes back 100 years later in the 1980s, and I can't unsee the dress from that movie when I look at this one. The dress is covered in faux pearl trim and lace. You can also see small silk flower bows on the neckline and hip, and according to newspaper articles on the wedding, the bride wore a tulle veil. There is slight splitting on the silk in the skirt, which you can see here, and a hidden detail includes this very thick lace trim underneath the hem of the skirt. Here are the pearl beads up close, which match the cuffs and the back of the dress, which is fastened with hooks and eyes. They even added this lace trim on the edge, which shows attention to detail. And the dress does include a label, which says Duval and Egan robes. Duval and Egan was a design house that made dresses sometime between the 1880s and 90s, and I can't find more info, but the Met has one of their gowns here, and I found another dress online of theirs here. Here's a full-length shot of the gown again, so you can compare it to Sarah's dress in Labyrinth, which was impossible to find a good full-length photo of, but you get the idea. Same sleeves, same pointed waist. These are the photos we will use in our newsletter and database, so thank you for watching, and let me know what you think.